Let's try you again. Boop. Oh, can't use that. Loading. Not activating the cooling system clearly didn't work, so let's try toggling it. Oh, they're, they just, oh, they shined. Is he like right here right now? He's not playing very nice. Does that mean the door is open? Looks green. Go away, dude. I got adult things to do. Got a long day ahead of me. I don't need your alien booty butt getting in the way of my thing. Shit. That's alien booty butt getting in the way of my thing. Get inside a room. Never spot me on here. Or he will, I don't know. Probably be doomed. There's the thing I needed. Oh, some of these bodies aren't even encased in anything. Oh. Oh, I thought there was like a spider monster coming out of this guy's chest, but that's just the weird cabling going around these each of these pieces of wall. All right, he seems to be gone. Gotcha. Gotcha, gotcha. Just leave me alone for like a moment longer. Just need to go back in this room. Come on. All right, here's the missing one. So is that where I needed to go? I mean, it's a thing you can interact with, so I'm sure it's worth using. I just don't know if there's something to accomplish in that room or not. I don't see an exit. I see a re- Oh, there's a rewire panel. Is he on the floor right now? Well, time to do this, just in case. Wow, the door is open. I can see the vent over there. And that vent's probably why I'm doing this, right? That low beep should mean he's far away. He's pretty far away. So I guess my goal is to get to the rewire panel and use that to open that vent, because that was that the power was closed off on that. Sneaky sneaky. Once I rewire, I'm just gonna go use that save point, because then I don't have to then all this gets saved. That'd be nice. Alright, we're in here. Please don't murder me, spooky alien. Because I can't hide in here at all. At all. We to turn off purification to open vent access. There's a Dr. Lingon, senior medical officer. Should be able to find out where they're keeping everything in her office. Good luck, Ripley. Hurry if you can. Okay, so now we have an office that's worth investigating somewhere in that general direction. Cool. I don't know what this part is over here that's all highlighted like I've been there before or something. Uh, might as well use the save because we've done all this. You coming down or not? No? I don't have to worry about about my save too much because if I if the save turns out to be bad and I get killed right after it, that just means that I'll have to start the mission over, which is only one puzzle ago. But hopefully this means I won't have to do that part again. Cool. All right, so I need an exit. How do I exit exactly? Is the door down there open now? Oh, right, the vent. Da da da. Sorry. Got distracted by map and map does not show vents. Make it count. Well, they haven't killed me yet. But don't put that past them. I wouldn't be that surprised if they murdered me in a mandatory event that I have to go through. 
<laughs> really? I hear footsteps. Ah, it's over there now. Well, crap. Better figure out- oh, okay. What? Well, that's a weird... Is it like a vague outline, I guess? Doesn't give me a lot to go on. Somewhere vaguely in front of me is the office I'm trying to get to. And because we can't even see rooms, I don't even know scale, really. Well, he's not on my radar right now. Hello, where's that of a room? This room's a mess. I've got a locker I can default back to. Seems like this is the only way I can go out. Oh shit. Oh shit. No idea where he was in respect to anything. Hey look, there's little photos. Look at them. They're gonna keep us company in Nightmare Land while my mouse freaks out. Oh, there he is. Hello, Death. How are you doing today? It sure is nice to see you. Uh-oh. That's not good at all. Oh, well. That was not... That was a very brief moment to find out that apparently right mouse bumper holds your breath. They say a split second before they kill me. <laughs> that wasn't very nice at all. Well, staying put didn't do me any favors, did it? Let's get moving. That's not a good sound. That wasn't a good sound at all. Where am I? Uh, I'm kind of going the long right way around. Uh, the map seems to indicate there wasn't anything over there anyway, though. So, guess I'll keep going. I'm about to die from behind our neck. Now it's getting quieter. It's getting quieter. Okay. There we go. Pretty alone right now. That's good. I'm sorry. Sorry if you liked a lot of the exploration that was happening near the beginning. That doesn't seem to be happening a lot right now, but uh, I'm constantly. Uh, uh, I'm constantly on the verge of dying in this game, which uh, discourages. Some of that exploration. Where do I hide in here? There we go. Yeah, I'm not big on exploration when I'm trying not to die. Context has changed a bit. When I feel like I'm in a story safe place or something where... Basically, if I haven't seen the alien or heard the alien, I'll try to explore, but times like this... Fuck that noise. I'm so fucked. <laughs> He's like right there, isn't he? Alright, well now we know right mouse bump- Man bu Oh, there's another one! <sighs> That's annoying. <laughs> like, right- like, last time he came up to me, like they're like, Hit right mouse button to hold your breath. I'm like, okay, I'll be ready this time. And this time I'm like, alright, right, right mouse button. They're like, press S to lean back. You're dead. C fucking... <laughs> were there ever tutorials about that that stuff? I don't think they've ever mentioned it before. They were just like sudden surprises. I don't know. Maybe on a maybe on console it's easier because they'll be like, hit X. And you're like, oh yeah, X. But like I'm like, uh, 
R and B. Oh yeah, right mouse button. Okay, cool. Uh, S. Okay, yeah. Uh, sure. <laughs> like, by the time I think about what they asked me to do, I'm already dead. That's a bummer. So explosion. Fuck. Followed by hiding in vents. Now get ready for right mouse button, burner button, and da and S. <laughs> At which point it'll say to also Alt F4. And shake your Game Boy upside down while pressing select to catch the Pokemon. He really does come straight for you, huh? Yeah, fun holding your breath. Well, there's a computer in here. Maybe that's useful. All right, so down and so pressing right mouse bumper and S did 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 do the trick. That one pipe bursts and back where we left off. Is that the sound of a? Is that the constant sound of a save point in the room, or is that just the monitor? <laughs> is he gone already? That is a save. Oh, that's nice. Go ahead and use this real quick. Yay. Oh shit, weren't you just not here? Like four seconds ago? Jeez, that wasn't very nice. I guess that was just the motion track. He must have just been still, I guess. Where the fuck are you? <laughs> this guy really likes math. Oh my god, is that Pythagoras? Oh, there he is, popping out of the vent. When did he have time to go in a vent, then show up in that room, then do that? He moves around so strangely. Yep. Oh, oh, there he goes back up the vent. Is he gone now? I mean, I saved already, so at least there's that bit of safety, but yeah. I'd like to investi investigate PC. Hello. Passcode required. Can I even look at a computer in safety? I mean, I saved already, so I kind of can. Colonial Marshal Directive. Dr. Morley, I don't care what you think you need to do. I want you out of San Cristobal now. You know we've set up uh, what we've set up in here, and I'm truly sorry for what it means for the patients who can't be moved. I'm about to die, aren't we? But this is the only way. There will be no further warnings. Marshall waits. And I'm gonna go to this one now. Morley, updating codes. Morley, I need you out of medical. We've set up shop in the habitation tower. People are fighting over supplies. We've got more injuries coming in than we have the meds to deal with them. And my team is depleted, to say the least. I don't know how to re you'll break the lockdown, but if you need access to San Cristobal's uh, central wards, the code is 2505. Alright, 2505 is the code to... The central wards is 2505. Does that also get us into the side room? That's, oh yeah, the code's prop. There's probably a key card in there. Okay. Oh, I'm dead now, aren't I? No, Ripley! Bye. Not even the computers are safe future sucks. <laughs> Thankfully, I have a save point right there. Unthankfully, I think he might spawn right there immediately. So let's just go back in here immediately. <laughs> oh no, I don't hear him. He is persistent. He's always in like the next room at all times and never goes anywhere else. Nope, he's coming straight to me, isn't he? Yeah, he is. Nope, he's going in the room in front of us. I just saw his shadow. Dude gets around. Alright. It claims he's in the vent now. Let's try this for real now. San Cristobal Lockdown. San Cristobal Medical has been locked down from Colonial Marshals. Until further notice, Sebastopol's medical team are... 
Setting up field hospitals throughout Sevastopol to deal with the ongoing crisis. Locations to follow. Emergency valve shut off. Ooh, to turn off the gas. An old friend. Dr. Lingard, this is Ransom. Remember me, your friend, chief executive. Lingard, you don't drop by, you don't call. Are we pals anymore? Oh well, we're both busy people. And after all, I have lots of other friends. Some of them have badges. One of them told me you called Marshall Waits about a, shall we say, interesting find? I want in. No arguments. After all, how much does Waits really know about you? Not as much as your old friend here. And I bet he wouldn't be as understanding about black market med supplies. I look forward to your call, Doc. Transitory patients must supply their crew number and docking registration. <laughs> There's a vent in this room, too? I didn't even notice that. Yeah, that's right. Being all gutsy, I'm sitting here actually checking audio logs, even though it calls the alien over. Boom. I did it for you. Alright, so the gas is unbreached. That's good. Is, is there another doorway that takes me over there, I suppose? We'll see. Is the alien gone? Not really. Says he's like right there. Oh. Go away, pretty please. Alright, that's my best chance for now. New save. Is that him? Yeah, let's make it work. Twenty-five, oh five. Key card. Now let's go back in there, just in case. I'm on my way. Really, no motion detected, even though I hear thumps. Oh, there it is. Alien's a dick. There he is. Alright, I figured he'd come by. Oh, there he is. Go away, pretty please. Please? Oh, here it comes. How does he always know which computer to check? I mean, which locker to stock? Gone. Wow, no, no sound. I'm not getting beeps. Another save. No, I can't. It's a dead end. So we're in now. This is where I need to be. Ooh, look at that. Haven't been caught yet. Alright. Making count. Dispensary is empty. Message for Lingard on his return. I've prepared the patients in the trauma ward for transportation as best I can before Waits locks the place down. Going upstairs to the psychic ward to make sure there is no stragglers. The dispensary is now empty. Is everything San Cristobal has to offer in terms of first aid and medicine is with you? Or else we're on station. I'm hoping you'll bring back good news, Morley. Did not mean to leave it. Death certificate. Foster C. Report Lingard. Uh, uh, can't actually read it. This is Lingard, senior medical officer at Sevastopol Station. And I want to. I want to stay. For the record. I have been 
I have been placed under duress with regards to compromise patient zero. And Ransom, Seagson's head of operations, he... He made certain threats for my career and my certification. I want that on record. God. Oh, me. That woman needed help. I didn't know what type of parasite she had encountered, but it had planted something inside her. I am so sorry. I had no way of knowing what would happen. Well, that's not good. We're talking about a face hugger and a chest burster and all that going on. Oh my god, how far away is my destination? Look how far away that is. Search operating theater for trauma kids. Like a billion years from here. I'm screwed. <laughs> um, so I want... There was a doorway over there because the alien was always hanging out over here. So that must be a way out. Probably just want to revisit the save point again because I don't have to come back here again. If I can get that to work. First priority is to go for the hiding spot. Yeah, he's probably going to come in here. He likes to come in here. Please leave. Oh, is that him coming in? Did I call it? There he is. You look a lot less green in this room. Okay, so he's not... He's not as alert in that situation. Okay. Let's make our way back to the save point next, if I can. And then continue on through the hallway we saw them in before. Is he right out there? Make it work. Get in there! Yay! Did I make? Did I actually make it? That was the question. Or is he about to burst in on me? God damn! He's always right there. <laughs> Alien has some personal space problems. Is what we're getting at. Probably abandonment issues. All being all alone in space, no father. Oh, poor guy. Nope. 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 Oh, there he is. I see him. Go in the vent. Although him being in the vent doesn't feel that much safer because there's a vent in this room, apparently. That's not great news for me. Oh, there he goes. Dude certainly gets around. Oh, he's like right on top of me. That's the high-pitched beep of proximity. There's the proximity. Speak of the goddamn devil. Every time I adjust my hand, the screen freaks out! Because the sensitivity is weirdly high when you're in these enclosed spaces. I've said that before, but yeah, whenever I visit like a save point or anything, that was weird. He had like an ongoing step sound, but then it cut off instantly. But whenever you enter an alternate camera spot, like a like a locker or a save point, you're suddenly dealing with like a, a high speed version of looking around. Am I about to die again? God damn it! God damn it, I- he just left. Alright. I hear ya. That's the sound of leaving? Yep, there, there he goes. Well, I'm saving the shit out of this progress. Thank you, conveniently located save location. Shit, I'm about to die, aren't I? Wow, he's right outside. What the fuck, man? We ch Go away! I need to stealth through the area, and you won't go away! Come on, man. It gets comical at some point how long you spend, like, right outside my room. Alright. Dick. 
Ah, even the sound is still like, hey, he's right on top of you. Screw you. I hear you. I hear you loud and clear. Oh, come on. He's like right on me. There he is. Going off the other direction, that's the best chance I'm gonna get for a while. Screw it, I saved. Let's just go for it. Or I'll be here forever. Hey look, he's gonna come out and- yep, there he is. Hi! No, I'm not really here. No, no, no. Alright. This one- this particular part of the game feels like a particularly small map, and he just like... won't leave the exact hallway I'm in for so long. Alright. Well, I just saved, so we'll try the same thing, but we'll throw like a noise thing down the hallway? How about that? He's not around right now. I don't think the alien saves. This is the last save loaded. But there's no alien. Oh, fuck me. No, go after the noisemaker over there. No, okay. Thanks. <laughs> I want to wait for the moment that he's not on my radar. Like, I understand it's stupid to move forward when he's clearly on my motion detector. I get that. Because he's on my motion detector, that means he's nearby. The problem is it feels like he's been nearby for like the last 30 minutes of gameplay no matter what I do. <laughs> so now I'm just trying to go for it because sometimes he's on my, mo my radar. Sometimes he's on, on my radar directly in front of me and nothing happens. Like he's like, oh nah, he was pretend in front of you, JK. So you never know for sure. Alright. Well, they made him unpredictable, congrats, but... It's a little frustrating, actually. Is he right? Oh, he's gonna come down the vent, isn't he? Is he right behind the door? He is right behind the door. There he goes. He just ran away. And he's coming back. Do I survive for five more seconds? That's the people of doomed. 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 Doomed? Doomed. He's way off that direction now. Watch him run straight to me though. I'm trying, man. Those are loud footsteps of me being about to die, huh? Fuck me. He's right behind me. I'm about to get impaled. Maybe he didn't see me. Did he not see me? He was right behind me a second ago, like what the fuck? Wow, I'm not- I'm like trying to hold the mouse still, but like slightly feeling twitchy with parts of my hand, basically. No, I'm leaning back. Go away. Hold your breath better, lady. No. Don't screw me here. No, oh, no. He wasn't far enough away. Wow, you're a dick. Hiding is only ever a temporary solution. I was in there for like 20 seconds. <laughs> okay. Okay, alien man. You don't like to play nice, do you? I just want to fly. Did he just disappear? That was weird. Was that a teleporting alien? Oh, I'm fucked. This is what being completely fucked looks like. I think I said that last time, though. 
thought he wasn't right there, and then he was right there. Uh, 